In today's video, I'll be showing you how to push your FPS in the Rainbow Six Siege. Don't fix any lags. So let's not waste any time and get into the video. So for the first step, what you want to do is you want to head over and click on your Windows tab and you want to type out Game Mode. Then you want to go ahead and turn on your Game Mode since this will optimize your PC for gaming. Then you also want to go ahead and turn off your Xbox Game Bar. Now for the second step, you want to go ahead and open up your NVIDIA Control Panel, click on Manage these Settings, you want to click on your Global Settings and you want to follow all the settings I do. So for your CUDA GPUs, you want to put that on all. And for the other settings on top, you want to simply turn off those settings. Then you want to scroll down and you want to put your low latency mode, you want to put that on ultra. Your max frame rate, you want to put that on off. And your preferred fresh rate, you want to put that on highest available. So once you're done with that, you want to simply click on program settings. And you want to choose your Rainbow Six Siege application. And you want to copy my settings. Your image scale you want to turn on. Your anti tropical filtering you want to put on 2x. Your monitor technology, you want to put that on G-Sync, depending on your monitor, if you don't have a G-Sync monitor, then you don't have to do that. Then you want to scroll a bit down, and you want to find preferred fresh rate, and then put that on the highest available. Then you want to head over to texture filtering, and you want to put that on on. Then you want to head over to texture filtering, under that, and you want to copy my setting. Your texture filtering quality, you want to put that on performance, since this will give you the best results. Then you want to head over to your vsync, and you want to click on use application settings. You can also turn it off. Your virtual reality pre-rendering, you want to put that on one. And once you're done with that, you want to go ahead and apply the settings. Now what you want to do is you want to go ahead and open up your Steam and you want to head all the way to your Tom Clancy and click on settings and properties. Then you want to head over to your launch options and you want to choose play Tom Clancy Rainbow Six and you also want to enable Steam overlay. Now for the game settings, what you want to do is your display performance metrics, you want to put that on minimal metrics and this setting will give the option to see your FPS. Then once you're done with that, you want to head over to the display tab and you want to put your resolution on 1080p. If you have a low end PC, put it on 720p. Your refresh rate, you want to put it on the highest refresh rate you have. Then you want to head over to your FPS limit and you want to put that on off. Your VSync, you want to turn the setting off. And your field of view, you can bump that all the way up. Now you want to head over to the graphics tab. And your NVIDIA Reflex Low Latency, you want to put this on on plus boost. Since this will give you the best results. Now heading down to the quality settings. You want to turn your texture quality, you put that on low. And to tropical, you want to put on 2x. Your LDQ quality, you want to put that on high. Your shading, you want to put that on low. Your shadow quality, that you want to put on medium. Your reflection quality, you can put on low. And all the other settings, you can put off. Now for your adaptive rendering scaling target with FPS, you want to put that on zero. Your anti-analysis, you want to put off. And that was the best settings. So if you found this video helpful, please give it a like. And also subscribe to this channel for more tips and tricks just like this. Anyway, you can watch this playlist to boost your FPS in other games.